Let me tell you something, folks. Whenever you see that sun crowned around the head of a deity, that is a sun god. And that is the fallen angel we know to be Satan. And when I say Satan, it's not just one being. Remember, as an angel, he had and still has other fallen angels underneath him. So even when we think of it as one being, the word is plural. But to further understand Santa Claus, we have to go back to the beginning. Now pay close attention because you'll soon see the connections. The first version of Satan, not his original form, came in the form of a serpent. Because he's a shapeshifter. Who tempted Eve and he gave her the gift of sight. He opened her eyes, so to speak, giving her the forbidden fruit. And he would go on to deceive the whole world. Remember that. Deceive the whole world, which is in scripture. Also keep in mind that this story was centered around a tree. Symbolically, placing gifts around a tree would represent the fruit of the tree. Which... Much like Eve sharing the fruit with her husband, people share the fruit of presents with their friends and family. Get it? The next form of him, Satan, came in the form of a goat. Serpent, then goat. Okay? Shamash, Utu, Babylonian sun gods. Moloch, Canaanite deity. All sun worship and all Santa Claus. Even this, the image that people think is Christ. Remember, the devil deceives the whole world, and even Christ himself said that there would be an imposter. This image of Jesus with the sun around his head, most people don't even think he looks like that anyway. So who is this person? Who is this really? And I'm not talking about the real Christ. I'm talking about this image of Christ, which is not supposed to exist. So who is this person? And folks, I gave you a clue, several clues. That is why when it comes to Christmas, this image and Santa Claus are interchangeable. You can swap them out for each other, right? You ever wonder where that image of Christ came from in the first place? Exactly. The Christmas tree is a pagan symbol of a deity. To you, it's just a tree. But it represents a deity in the pagan world. Who's the tree god? Kernunos, right? Or Surnunos. Which is Shiva. Or Surya. Which is closer to Santa Claus. Folks, do you see where I've gone with all this? You've been living in a dream world, friend. Christmas is a worldwide event. And the devil deceives the whole world. I'm not here to tell anybody what to do from this day forward. But I know what I'm going to do. Just something to consider looking further into. There is more to come.